Hey there everybody, Tim Allard with Ontario to Doors. Here are some steps that you can take to help prevent the spread of aquatic invasive species. The first thing you want to do is inspect your rig and clean it. So you're going to take a look at your trailer, your boat, your motor and your trolling motor. Make sure there isn't any muck, mud, other debris, mussels, plants hanging on that you could potentially carry from this water body to the next one you're going fishing to. Next we're going to drain the rig. We're going to take out the boat plug. We're going to lower the outboard, make sure there isn't any water in there. We're going to empty the live wells. And then you want to make sure you run your bilge just to flush any water that might be in that system as well. You should also dry your rig in hot weather or sunny conditions like we have here today for two to seven days before trailering it to a new water system. For the best cleaning, you have two options. You can hose this whole thing down with a high pressure washer of about 250 PSI, or you can use a hot water solution to clean it down. It's really important to dry out your live wells and to prevent the spread of VHS, what you can do is clean them out using a bleach water solution consisting of 10% bleach. And then once you've done the cleaning, rinse it down with fresh water to get rid of any residual chlorine. In the grand scheme of things, these steps don't take very much time, but you know what? They make a huge difference in protecting our waterways and helping stop the spread of aquatic invasive species. Thanks for watching. See you next time.